think that you're saying for you to tell black women to, to that procreate with black men, which my son is a black male, to, to go and abort their black boys is absolutely ludicrous because if you have ever had to terminate your pregnancy, which I have because I'm disabled and it was the most gut-wrenching thing I've ever gone through, you don't know what that feels like and what it does to a person. So for you to go through you and spread the masses. How does it feel to be left a single mother where the man tells you I'm not going to raise my child at all and you got to take responsibility? How gut-wrenching. I am a single mother, mother okay? And I I am raising my son alone and, and I'm a single raising, mother because my son's father son was murdered. Okay. Community. So I do know what it is to be a single mother and to raise my son alone. So okay, you don't that's sit here and psychologically damaging as an abortion. People get abortions all day, every day. Stop it. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Yes, they do have abortions every day and all day. And if you've never gone through it, you don't know what it's like to go through and have that and and to go through the trauma because it's traumatic. And you can't speak for every woman. It's not traumatic for everyone. And neither can you. Have you had one? I don't need I don't need to have one to know that it's not traumatic for every woman. It's not. Well, if you've never gone through it, then don't speak on something you can't attest to. No, actually, to. I can't speak on it. I worked at an abortion clinic. where Then you should know. If you worked at an abortion clinic, woman. then you should know. When you walk up those doors, you've got people with signs and everything else protesting, no, no, and they don't even know why you you're there. That. Okay? It is a very traumatic experience, no, and it is not. nothing not that you anyone. should promote. It should be somebody else's personal experience if they want to go through it. But for you to sit up there and to tell people when you've not walked a day in their shoes that they should sit up there and throw away their kids when you have not gone through it yourself is the most hypocrite thing that I have ever heard in my no, life. Not. No, it's not. It no, is. No, it's not. No, it it's is. not. Telling a woman that she needs to be a single mother and go through the hardship of being a single mother in poverty, you're wrong for telling them Who's that. Who's the they would be in poverty? What's best for them. You're talking I'm about two them. things that Maybe. I have experienced myself, being a I single mother of a black this. male and I have terminated my pregnancy. I have done both. So Ma'am, you're speaking to somebody who has raised her child alone and is going to school to be a doctor Okay, so to tell me my son and is a dusty, much easier is if you had gotten an abortion. And if it would have been much easier to do that if you had gotten an abortion. Keep it a buck. You will not what, have what would have been more easier if I would have gotten, gotten an abortion. You terminated your pregnancy. Stop it. I say that again? And you wouldn't have struggled as much going to school if you had gotten an abortion. It would have been a lot easier on you. I Keep it a buck. You struggled. My son is my son is going to school. Mother. You did my son, mother. are you listening? So, w- be quiet for a second so you can hear what people are saying. My son is going to school to to medical school. He is going to school to be a doctor, and I okay. did that. Okay, so what's okay? the point? And I did what's that because point? his father was murdered. Listen, listen, open up your ears and listen. So it wasn't a choice to be a single parent. I, I was put into a position.